In Avid Media Composer, there is an easy way you can add filler to the end of a sequence. This is practical for shows that need to be an exact amount of runtime. In this example, I already have a show that runs for 30 seconds, and I want to create a 60 second version of it. Hold down the Option key or the Alt key and right click in the timeline area to create a new video track. In doing so, this will allow you to add a new empty track with any track number assigned to it. Use a track number that will exceed the normal amount of tracks that you typically use in a sequence. Navigate to the very end of your sequence. Within the new empty track, make sure the track is active. Press the Add Edit function. Don't worry, nothing will appear to happen. Next. Press the P key on your keyboard. This will enter into ripple trim mode on the left side of an invisible edit point. On your keyboard keypad, type plus 30 seconds or whatever value you want to add as filler to the end of your sequence. Now, if you don't have a full size keyboard, press the control key twice rapidly. Then you can use the regular numbers below the function keys on a truncated keyboard. Now, you will want to lock the filler track. To do that, right click on the track and choose Lock Track. Navigate to the Timeline Fast menu and you could choose to hide the track if you choose. So now, when you zoom out of your sequence, you have a fixed timeline that represents the exact amount of footage you will need to complete the spot. Okay, great, that's it. For other tips and tricks like this, or to become a Media Composer certified user, visit GeniusDV.com.